Hello everyone, it's Darina. Welcome back to my channel. And the video, as you can see, I have gorgeous mug. Best teacher ever. Miss Darina. This uh, present was for my boyfriend at my 20th birthday. Yes, at 28th of April I had a birthday, so now I'm 24 years old. So old. I'm drinking now Nescafe. I have my day off. It's already third day. Because we had like uh, first of May is like day of uh, workers. Supposed to be government to give the day off, but they a little bit uh, change date at Thursday. So Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And tomorrow we need to go work. <laughs> like come back from this long uh, holiday, and I'm just. Uh, realizing that I'm this kind of person who who better like work without any stop and when you have just slightly relaxed like you have just one day off or something like few days after for me oh my god I don't wanna go I wanna stay in my shell and I just wanna a little bit share with you what happened with my life for these months uh, from my last video or dog. So as a son, I'm going um, home, Russia, at the end of the May, and I'm so excited because I want to see my family. I want to spend time with friends and just like change location because I'm already one year in <laughs> Egypt and it's gorgeous, it's good, but I wanna also see my relatives. <laughs> Unfortunately, I think like maybe eighty percent I'm going alone without my boyfriend. And I'm some, feeling uh, sometimes uh, sad because of this, uh, because I wanna like uh, show him my country. I wanna show him uh, everything, and I'm just feeling like all of this fun, what I will have, and it will be without him. It will be so sad because I wanna share these feelings, these moments with him. But I hope maybe something will change. He's telling me this every time, like something will change in these three weeks, and he can go with me. And I will be so happy and I'm going to go for one month, maybe a little bit more, I don't know. Because here I'm having work at the nursery. I don't know if I was telling you this. Um, yes, I had it like interview um, uh, nursery near to, to my home and I ex they accept me and I'm a teacher, as an English teacher right now, working already third month I think no uh, I'm working two months and a half so um, or maybe third I don't know <laughs> I, have a, I don't know what happened I think because of 18 now I don't look so okay but tomorrow I need to come back work so I'm trying to drink something hot so uh, that's why I have a work and when I ask like my boss, she wasn't so happy that I'm going for a month Of course, it's like a long period But I told her like I want to go anyway So she told me like this uh, when you will return uh, Call us if we will still have a place for you like a position will be available We will take you if it's not not because we will search someone uh, in this period uh, in your position uh, she's telling me it's like 80% we will take you, but maybe a little bit uh, different position. Like I will not be have uh, just junior class, so I will, um, uh, I will my day will be like this. I will go to baby class, junior class, Montessori class, uh, preschoolers, and like this, like uh, different stages. And by the way, I like this more, and I hope I hope it will be like this because I will just focus on um, my lessons and that's it. Because, uh, like right now, I don't see I'm 100% as an English teacher. I'm also as a, like, I don't know how to say, like a nanny, maybe who are responsible for discipline, for how they like eat, and all this. Like, I have a program, I'm responsible for this, like, too many stuff, and it's a little bit disturbing, a little bit make me exhausted. Uh, and um, it will be better if I will be just English teacher, preparing my lesson, give to kids. And that's it. What else? I hope really that my English uh, every time improving. That's why I'm making these videos like once per, um, per month maybe or like 
once per two months i don't know so i wanna after time see how it uh, improved but i'm really working on it because like uh, all of my tiktok right now it's um english lessons and i really i really think that it have a point that i really will learn from through tiktok i don't wanna like have a courses or uh, i don't know uh, go to yes i'm it's youtube also helping but i mean like now it's a little bit different of learning and i much better remembering uh, videos from tiktok because they're like uh, short and so like full of information and of course i'm trying like i'm reading uh, now english books uh, and uh, i'm i don't know focus on my vocabulary i want to make it like wider and all that stuff because I just realized that like, yes, I want to be teacher as an English teacher because I think it uh, will open for me a lot of opportunities, like work uh, in um, international schools, not only in Egypt. I'm planning in other countries, and maybe one day it will be like I don't know USA or England, uh, England like English speaking country, and I will be the English teacher. Yes, I'm a not native speaker, like my uh, my mother tongue is Russian. But I think it's possible uh, to learn uh, so fluently, to be to get to become a native speaker uh, through time. I think it's really possible. And my, um, you know, it's like I don't know. I change my vision of English. Before I was obsessed about English. I like it so much. I like how it sounds. I wanted to talk English my whole life, like full time. But now i'm maybe double obsessed because i know now that i'm enjoying like teaching and especially with kids and stuff so i want to improve as a teacher i mean uh, i hope like inshallah yeah that i learned here <laughs> in egypt like with god's help i hope that um, i will get a bachelor's degree as uh, in education because unfortunately i don't have it even like uh, i had experience uh, working with kids before in russia and here but like um, the specialization yes uh, they let letting me working with kids without education but some some of work some of nurseries and schools they uh, it's like better level they're asking of education and i want to be quali like qualified qualified uh, specialist so I want to have a show degree and I want exactly as an English teacher of course like right now where can I get it I want to go if I, when I will go to Russia if I will get, have enough time I want to apply to university in Russian university so uh, after time yes I think uh, this diploma I can translate it and it uh, will be I think valuable and no so I'm gonna try like this and uh, to get some courses like in Montessori, in um, courses of teaching it itself English, and I wanna try to make TOEFL or IELTS test to improve. So for this, I need to improve my level, and I wanna like I think now I'm between B1, B2, like intermediate and upper intermediate, but I think <laughs> more intermediate, not too much upper intermediate. Uh, I don't know, but I want to be C1, C2, like advanced and fluent native speaker. And another reason why I want this, not just only for be better in a job, be better in a, like a teacher, and I want to also create a better future for my uh, kids, for our kids, yes, because i didn't have this opportunity to learn a few languages at the early childhood i think this is brilliant and great because like i to, <laughs> to be like right now in this intermediate for me it's take like i don't know how many 20 years or something because i started learning from school yes it wasn't like so good uh, teachers and i was maybe so highly motivated so it was takes too much time and now maybe i'm a little bit like okay good but still not perfect but I want to uh, improve my language to give after my kids and uh, I want uh, them to know uh, too many languages like exactly I want them to know Russian like I don't know how it's called Bailan, Bailan, something I don't remember I 
persons like uh, who who learn in the same time few languages. Um, so I want him know Russian because it's my mother tongue and uh, anyway, as how can I understand him if something happens? I need to so Russian, English. I want to make him like learn this in the same time and. Uh, as my future husband uh, slash uh, boyfriend, he know Arabic. He's a, this is his mother tongue, and I don't have anything against uh, if um, our kid will learn a third, third language, third. But the priority is like Russian, English, maybe in the same station as Arabic. So it will be depends, of course, where we will live because if like he will go to kindergarten and there will be Arabic area and at home will be like Russian English, it's good. If it will be outside English, it's also good. So uh, of course I'm planning also, I don't know, maybe like uh, hire a nanny or something who will like be native speaker English. It will be so good if we will not live in, in English area, like English speaking uh, country. So it's another solution, but I want to know also good English, so I can give him. And it's a great opportunity, really. When you know few languages from like your birth, it's like your native speaker of few, few languages, and it's it's perfect, I think. So now it's like my now main goal, and a little bit feeling like my this stuff of drawing and all this it's like going on the second uh, like i don't know stage or something so a little bit uh, lose focus on this and i don't know i feel sad and at the same time maybe not because if i feel like an occupation of uh, being an english teacher and learn english i think it's not bad because uh, it was also one of my uh, biggest desire so what else so soon i'm going home um i think our like i don't know problems a little bit start to solve like financial maybe some of like you know um problems solve i don't know oh my god chicken oh my god i'm sorry i might oh my god i made so high five i don't forget it oh i can still smile <laughs> okay sorry so that's it uh dog <laughs> oh what is this <laughs> by the way about dog i don't like her i don't want her and i'm fighting to put her somewhere else <laughs> i don't want this pet but it's another story but so soon maybe she will raise puppies so it's okay but we can <laughs> let her stay a little bit because we will help it Just checking what I'm doing. What? Odd. <clears throat> so, uh, and I'm searching for too many vacancies, uh, sending resume to another countries, uh, try as a teacher. But I've, of course, I know that I need to improve. So, this is now like uh, my mind occupied of this. And that's it. I think uh, like I'm happy that I'm start to find something what I like, like to be really passionate. That's it. Um, but I'm also like still dreaming about, I know uh, traveling uh, all over the world. Don't be, not not to be, you know like uh, settle in one city in one uh, country and be have a job and like to be free. So um, I'm also thinking of like uh, start maybe start the teaching online, so I can uh, easily be in any place, uh, maybe part time job of online teaching and uh, like travel everywhere. So, but for all of this, I need to work, self educate, improve myself, which I'm now doing, and I hope I'm doing well. And uh, I'm really, really, really believe that one day I will achieve these goals so I wish you all also have some goals and you were um, having steps toward these goals and I hope and I also believe in you that you will one day achieve it but uh, in my experience I just uh, realized that don't need to rush the process just trust the process and one day everything will come not in the same day don't need to be so so rushed don't need to be think like okay after one year i need to be 
millionaire and have everything at your feet so it's like you have still your life and doesn't matter at which day you will be successful at which age like at 16 or 17 even it's all right you know like life still going and even when you're not young because i was thinking like this oh my god like 40 i'll be so old so like uh, life end for me or something so i feel i thought i thought like life is just young age but it's not i think too many benefits in um, like uh, elder yeah older age and i think you're getting wiser better and it's good age too so that's why i'm just have my puff and i'm trying to not be worried that's it thank you for watching in see you maybe after one month or something if i will have some news i will make video thank you bye